On this new Trek mountain bike, a regular bottle cage won't work because of the lack of space in the center of the frame. As an alternative, what's needed are side loading cages instead. Like on most mountain bikes, there are two mounts for bottle cages on the main bars. The good thing is that the screws are already included on the bike. And these are the water bottle cages I'm going to install today. As mentioned before, these are side loading and exactly what I need. They also come with their own screws and washers for convenience. Ok, so I'll start on the vertical bar by using an allen wrench to remove the existing screws. Now I'll line up the bottle cage with the holes in the bike frame and insert the top and bottom screws. At this time it's a good idea to make sure the bottle cage is facing the right way. On this one, both ends almost look the same so just take a quick look. There's not much room to work here but finger tighten as much as you can. Then use an allen wrench to finish securing the bottle cage. When done, this is not going to come off. Since this package came with two bottle cages, I'll quickly install the second one. And then I'll show you how the bottles go in here. These days I'm seeing more and more bikes with extremely angled frames that leave very little space in the center. Because of the small space, a bottle can't be loaded directly from the top, which is why they invented side loading cages. As you can see, they're super simple to install. And I've listed these exact bottle cages in the description so it's easy for you to find. Okay, so these are perfect for this medium sized Trek Marlin. And you can see how tight the space is. But it's no problem sliding bottles in and taking your water with you. If your bike is like mine, then these side loading bottle cages are exactly what you need. If this video was helpful, please give me a thumbs up and hit the subscribe button to stay up to date on all my DIY videos.